Veuillez accueillir la prochaine patineuse. Representing Russia. Maria Sotskova. Anytime you hear representing Russia now in ladies skating, you know you've got a skater out there who could make noise at the Olympics. That's how many are on the scene. Here's the 17-year-old, Maria Sotskova, currently in third after the short program. Shore program, she received it under rotation on a double axle, but hit a triple triple. She opens with a triple lutz, triple toe, arm over the head, very difficult in both jumps. over the head is predominantly a very Russian thing to do. You don't see it from skaters from other countries as much as you do in Russia. The talent among those Russian ladies is so deep, you have to find any way to overcome. That's your Brian Boitano. <laughs> She won a silver medal at the Junior World Championships in 2016 and then came on the senior scene last year and right out of the gate won two medals in the Grand Prix, made it to the Grand Prix final. Remember the top six in each of the disciplines after this series of six events will make it to the final. The depth of talent in Russian ladies skating is so deep and around the world is so deep. Maria really has gotten her place on the world stage through consistency. She doesn't have the best jumps. She doesn't have the most interesting programs. She doesn't have the best skating skills. But the fact she's been able to put it together consistently is what's gotten her so far. Nice triple loop there. overhead on almost every element and you have to be careful especially on tired legs towards the end of the program it makes it that much harder and you don't want to compromise the quality of the jumping element your center of gravity when your arms are one or two over your head goes way up from being about chest level to being up around your face and it's really hard to control from head to foot on a triple lutz if it's a little bit off Do you think that's recognized fully by the judges? It definitely is. Yevgeny Medvedeva, the winner of basically all the things over the last two seasons, has taken the level of ladies skating so high technically that you have to keep up. And Maria, while it isn't the most aesthetically pleasing arm over the head on her jumps, she's still going for those grade of execution points. Johnny, you're right, she's consistent and that's where she excels. Overall, there's probably a few mistakes. The technical callers will have to go back and check that she got full rotation, but a good solid skate. 
definitely the class of the field thus far. I think it's a great feature that she's added the arm over the head. And artistically, it wasn't in your face and wild, but it was pretty to watch. Back in the kiss and cry with a 17-year-old from Russia, Maria Sotskova. Remember, third place and just under 10 points off the lead after the short. So there's the number for the free skate. From what we've seen, uh, Maria was definitely the best skater so far. But you've got Kaylin Osmond coming up as well as Anna Pagadila. In the first place right now, though, Maria Sotskova, one of those names certainly in the mix for Russia when you look at the three that will go to the Olympics.